Trying to lose weight? You might want to give green tea a try. There are green tea drinks and pills, both promising the same thing, to boost your metabolism and help you burn fat. The question is, does it really work? Got the answers, Parth and Andy. Doctor, what do you think? Does it work? I, I think it's uh, there's something to it. You know, I think that uh, green tea is better than drinking some of the other drinks. There's been some studies to show that you know over over time that it actually can reduce weight. Not a, not a whole lot, but uh, it can reduce weight and increase the metabolism. So I actually don't mind it. We you know we hear a lot about green tea that doesn't have to do with weight loss. But what are some of the other benefits? Yeah, it's an antioxidant. So green tea is not processed like other teas. So it basically can prevent cell damage. It can regulate blood pressure, help your heart. You know, so I think overall it's positive. And here's the key: if you drink a cup or two of green tea instead of a can of soda, guess how many calories you save in a year? Oh, a year. A million. 50,000 <laughs> calories. That's, that's, still, that's great. 15 pounds in a yeah. year. So Incredible. that's to me is the key. You know, kids that drink all the sugary drinks, uh, you know, drink uh, green tea instead. I love right. it. Hey, tis the season when co coworkers start coming into work sick, hacking, sneezing, yeah, and all that. I know. Why do we do it? We've all done it, right? Experts looked at 61 studies and found most people show up sick because of the demands of their job and the fear of discrimination if they miss a day. Bottom line here most people said if the illness is not debilitating or contagious, it's okay to show up for work sick, hmm. but I mean, a cold is contagious. Most sicknesses are contagious, really. Yeah, right? exactly. You know, if you want, if you don't want to give something to your child or or somebody else you love, you you don't want to bring it to your your work. So if it's contagious, definitely. The second thing is day one when you're calling in sick, you know, think about it yourself and make the decision. Day two, go to your doctor. The third one is that if you're going to take medications to help with with your cold or whatever sickness, mm -hmm. if it interferes at work then you shouldn't go. And lastly, if your kids are sick and you're on the borderline, stay home with the kids because kids can spread this pretty easily. Absolutely. Right, quick look at 5 o'clock. Yeah, you know, so a lot of people suffer from cholesterol. Guess what? They have a vaccine now mm. that can reduce cholesterol. So some smart people that you don't want to miss this. Yeah, we'll be watching.